Good morning all, welcome to my channel. Welcome back if you are one of my 14 subscribers. Thank you so much for being here. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do. Make sure you like this video because I need all the help with the algos that I can get. So today I was going to do a little two month recap and like a little update on how living at the cottage has been going, but I've decided to switch gears a little bit and just complain about the bugs because the situation here is pretty dire at this point. So we've been here for a week now. It's Friday that I'm filming and we've been loving it. I'm just gonna show, well I guess I'll just have to turn this. Oh yeah. Yeah, that's, that's the backyard so I definitely cannot complain that much, but We've been having a bunch of stuff being getting set up. I don't know what sentence that was. Been having a lot of stuff set up. We had to get the washer installed a couple days ago and the faucet repaired and yeah, just like buying a bunch of kind of stuff to cook with because that's important. So a couple days ago, I came back on the deck and I saw a couple of cockroaches and it was nighttime so that's really neither here nor there. There was a couple of cockroaches on the deck and the exterminator came yesterday. While he was like doing this extermination process, he figured out that our washing machine was leaking, this like newly installed washing machine, and there's a huge puddle under this washing machine. We had to clean that up and then let our landlord know that there was a problem with the plumbing, which the plumber had to come anyways to still fix the bathroom faucet anyway, so that's gonna get sorted out. But anyways, as we're cleaning up this water, we discover in the garbage can that there's like a nest of gecko eggs. It was it was just mortifying. It was so gross. They're like, I, I didn't take a picture or anything because I don't want to traumatize anyone else because Sean and I are already traumatized enough by this whole fiasco. But they're like teeny tiny little eggs, like this big. They look like little dinosaur eggs. And there was like at least 50 of them. Like I'm gonna say probably more like 100. We disposed of those like it was just fiasco after fiasco half an hour doing the washing machine half an hour getting rid of these eggs and finally got those all sorted out it was just it was gross though and i'm like clearly this place hasn't been occupied for a while so there's just lots of creepy crawlies coming out i'm also looking at the pool right now and there's like some sort of weird plastic thing and i'm like is this an exoskeleton like i just don't know anymore because this is what you get with cottage life, apparently. Dealt with the gecko eggs. They were all dried up and old anyway, so it wasn't a big deal. It's not like there was baby geckos or anything in there, thank God. And then this morning I woke up really early because there was monkeys on the roof and decided to go out and check out the sunrise. So I went out the front door and then like around the corner to the backyard a little bit and I got to the side of the pool and I saw a dead cockroach, which I was fully expecting because when I lived in Australia, I did a bug extermination treatment, like just an at-home one. And the day that I did it, when I came back after like letting it do whatever it did for a couple hours, like you're not supposed to be in the house when you do these extermination things, came back, there was just cockroach carcasses everywhere. It was awful. So I was fully expecting this to happen, but it was still gross because I hate cockroaches. I really like, I don't mind bugs that much, but cockroaches, I can't do. It's just, that's the, that's the line. So there's a dead cockroach over there. I went back inside. When Sean woke up, I told him about the cockroach. And then I, we decided to go straight out the back door. And like we found, I think we counted eight cockroaches because there, I initially counted seven, but then there was a dead one in the pool. And like some of them were big, very, very big. So there was a dead worm, like actually it wasn't even a worm, it was, it was something gross, I don't know what it was, but I'm horrified. So Sean went inside and well, I was making breakfast and he found a cockroach on the inside as well. So now I'm like nowhere safe. There's nowhere we can escape. We're doomed. So that's been the whole bug fiasco. If you haven't yet click the subscribe button like this video comment if you have any questions or whatever and follow me on instagram thanks so much for watching and we'll see you next time